There are many spiritualists and teachers that believe in the concept of lower and higher self. The lower self being you in your most unbalanced state and your higher self being you in your most in tune state. You recognize that you are indeed an infinite being. Interesting way to see things, but I see things a little differently. In reality, there is no lower and higher self. The, the idea of the separation is it's an illusion. We live in a third dimensional plane of existence. There is duality here. Uh, no one is ever just one way. Nothing will ever be rainbows and butterflies 24-7. <laughs> we experience things as human beings. We, we experience emotions and it's natural. It's very much so natural. So when we, when we, when we think about this programming, and it is a programming of the subconscious, it's like splitting into two different beings instead of one whole. Like, we are whole. It doesn't matter where we are in any point of our journey. We are already whole. So there, there is no, there is no better or worse. There is only you. I think a lot of people become trapped in trying to achieve that perfection instead of letting themselves letting themselves express whatever is in their soul it's uh, you know it's if you're feeling low certain days that is very okay that doesn't make you a lower being it just means you're human now I wouldn't recommend sitting in that low vibration that that will be um, counterproductive but you're allowed to express and feel and just be because you are a human you're an infinite being but you're still a human at the same time <laughs> we're still here in this third dimensional plane of existence so my advice would be to see yourself as only your higher self you're only high it's, you are just the high of high and it, you don't have to be perfect and happy all the time it's that's not what it means you just you're always you always have that knowing in your heart that no matter what you go through you're gonna make it through it and you can achieve whatever you want to achieve whatever you're feeling in that moment it's just the vibration of that moment you have the power to change any thought any emotion within your own consciousness all it takes is your belief yep <laughs> yeah that's all I wanted to say so I see you guys later. Bye-bye.